we've rented out this whole museum. It was one of the only places in the country where you could be uh, arrested, um, tried, condemned and executed on the same day. Oh, oh that was a crossing. Hi. Watch this. this is good. Get, get up. up. Get up. That was a man though. Yeah. Yeah. Help. Oh my god, straight as clip watches. Okay boys, we made it to the third location on the trip. Now this place is something special. We've rented out this whole museum. The entire place. The night at the museum. museum. This place is huge! Night at the haunted museum. So right now we're unloading all the stuff. We've got uh, till 5 a.m. here, is it? Probably. 5 a.m. Uh, it's 8 p.m. right now, so yeah, it's a good amount of time. We've got a lot of stuff to see here. This place is not only just a courthouse. It wasn't only just a, a, a jail cell. It wasn't only like town hall, but it was also the hanging gallows. And they used to hang them right here. Outside. Wow. And right behind us, they used to watch and pay for rooms uh, for privilege of seeing the neck snap and strangle to death. Seeing the expressions on the face as they choke. <sighs> that is evil. These people are freaking We'd be that is evil. By that. Yeah. Welcome to, we know how we're welcome to, to that. medieval England, boys. Yeah. Are you not entertained? But yeah, <laughs> and there's also a demonic cave underneath that is said to be a very active demonic poltergeist that, hmm. that literally. In, in the words of the owners, or the administration, uppercuts people. Oh wow. The uppercut demon. The uppercut demon, okay. But yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't already, consider subscribing, hit that like button. This trip is going to be immense, and we haven't even shown you the best yet. <laughs> I mean, we, you guys don't even know the stuff we've got planned, so yeah, subscribe to the channel and to the boys you already yeah. know. Gang. Oh, are you boys ready? You boys ready? We have this, it's, like, amazing entrance sound. to the sound. soundtrack they're playing for us as we walk up here. That, that is called the fanfare. Oh, is They it? know we're in town, yeah. They, they know we're, we're in town, so they're playing the fanfare. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I mean, we part like we stole it, but it doesn't matter, I guess. True. No one has to know. Yeah, let's go. And the ghost. And the ghost. Whoa, wait for me, guys! Snooze, you lose! Snooze, you lose. Okay. 1400s. Um, pretty much the same same sort of skin, just the, the uh, same skeleton, just the skin sort of changed a lot. Um, just brought you into a Victorian courtroom. This was a Whoa. sort of walk, working courtroom oh, up until the mid 90s. Back to the. Wow. So you've got the, uh, the judge's chair. This is the. Uh, the galleries. The, so this is just chairs. And then we've got the public viewing galleries. And then right across the very top. All the way around. Wow. So this was a, a courtroom from like what year? Um, this, this was actually uh, updated and modernised um, in the very, very early 1800s, but there has been, it's been the centre of justice for Nottingham since about the 1400s. Oh, wow. Um, it was a, a, in the early days a Shire Hall, and then it became sort of the, the local sort of prison, police station, and then the, the sort of the courtrooms. So people were actually brought here for various crimes. Um, some were deported. We've got a deportation area where they were sent, waiting to be sent off to Australia. Others were hanged, sentenced, sentenced to death. Other people were just sort of fined. Wow. Mm -hmm. So, so this was the place where they would like judge your your what your crime was, like to hang you in the yeah. outside yeah. where the stairs are. Yeah. There was uh, two places for hanging in the in the early days, sort of 14, 15, 1600s. The hangings took place on the front of the building, and if you go to the front, you can actually see um, the sort of the original marks where the gallows were set up. Oh my God! Without crossing the road. 
You've got the, the hotel which is now there, that's been a hotel and an inn. They used to actually sell tickets for the hanging day so they could, people could have the best rooms to watch to get the best view of that. Yeah, oh, I didn't know you yeah. would do that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. People probably do that in the black market nowadays. Like getting your tickets to, yeah, I don't know, there's some sick stuff going on in the dark web. But, but uh, do, you want to, do you want to elaborate for these guys because they might not know about why they would get sent to Australia? Uh, yeah, okay. yeah, what happened there? Yeah, yeah so, uh, some of the. Um, Interesting. So the were deemed to be um, punishable by death. So the next worst thing that you could get was, was sent to Australia because it was it was an, an empty, barren land um, with no sort of um, no facilities. Or something. It was basically the prison country. The, yeah. So really? Australia was founded on our yeah, prisoners. Yeah, yeah. I knew about that because my yeah. Australian friend told me that like, yeah, yeah. in Australia, everyone's from the UK, but they're just yeah. criminals. They're just criminals. Yeah, exactly. I yeah. Go to Australia. Yeah, I've massive spiders there. Yeah, that's true. I don't want to go there. That's true. Yeah, yeah. Well, there is an, uh, an interesting story. You can add this in if you like. Um, there's a place called Gloucester Prison. Mm -hmm. if you've heard of it. Yeah. And um, it's got um, a particular very famous hanging there called the Granny Hanging. And it was Kylie Minogue's great, 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 great grandmother. And she was hanged at Gloucester Prison for stealing sheep and bread. Really? Um, yeah. Her husband was sort of basically aided and abetted. Yeah. He was actually sent to Australia as his punishment. Hence why Kylie Minogue ended up in Australia. Wow. <laughs> Don't know who that was, but there's Kylie Minogue, she's a, pop, she's a pop singer. This is crazy. Really famous yeah. pop singer. Yeah, Kylie Minogue. Yeah. I don't know. I oh, she's really famous well, pop singer. Well, viewers might know. Oh, of yeah. course they will. You have to know the viewers now. Yeah. Dang, all right. He doesn't know Kylie Minogue. <laughs> <laughs> what about Danny? Danny Minogue, like no? Danny Minogue. Straight over the head. Jason Donovan, no chance. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know anything. <laughs> I guess the judge doesn't <laughs> know. Okay. So, yes, the... Do you know? The hanging... Yeah. Well, hanging, but it's all interesting uh, about hanging. The public hangings in the, in the England in particular were like a day out, like a family day out. So hundreds and hundreds of people used to come and it was a big sort of party atmosphere and, and every time one of the poor souls was left there to sort of dangle, they died about 20 minutes later just sort of twitching away. Everybody was really sort of big party atmosphere and it was, it was seen as a, a big day out really, like going, wow. to a, going to a sort of fun fair or yeah. something like that. Um, so everybody sort of had drinks and every time one of these poor unfortunate souls was um, hanging away there they'd have a big swig of ale and after about eight or nine hangings they were hanged. yeah plastered so what did they go home with and wake up with the next day a hangover oh. No. Oh. i told you we need to we need to hire someone we're drunk kit in the background <laughs> yeah, we're missing it yeah we're missing it Man. I didn't know we're dropping puns now. Yeah. Yeah, that's good. Comedian yeah, so, channel coming so soon. So after public hangings, they then became more private affairs. So um, the people that were still hanged here, but they were taken downstairs where we're going to go shortly. Oh. Um, put in a cell and then basically executed. Now, the, the method changed of hanging because it was seen to be quite barbaric. So they, they, they had what they call the long drop method. Mm. So they worked out your body height, your body weight, and the length of the rope needed. So when you actually fell, you had to be snatched. And, it and that's still down there? Broke, yeah. Yeah. Um, they hang the cell's yeah. still there, but there is a makeshift gallows identical to what it was. In oh, that. I see what you mean. Cool. Yeah. Dang. Question now. So, so, I know back in the day, there was like this thing where you just, like, they put your hand in there. And the gallows. Oh, is that still gallows? The gallows? Well, not the hanging one, but the they just... Team? Yeah, they just kind of kept you there. Throw the the throw, yeah, for all vegetables, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do they do that here in front? And a, a lot of the villages uh, you go to have got, the, got these um, stocks. The yeah. Like stocks. Yeah. And you, you were put in there, and it was things like if you, and again, punishment would be would be uh, doled out from places like this. If you were a, a baker and you maybe sold stale bread, right? Then oh. you would be put in there, and the villagers would be back along and pelt you with stale bread. Damn, I'm yeah. if it's like Damn. the first day that the bread went stale. <laughs> Damn, I'd be pissed if one awful. of you guys threw like a tomato at me. <laughs> I wonder if it feels like a snowball or something. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. No, I'd the, be upset. the fish man never sold bad stuff because that would have been really good. Yeah, <laughs> so, but, always new. If he was gonna give you a hanging because they cut a black cloth over the top of their head. Oh that way you knew hanging was coming. Yo, this place means business then. This is haunted. Oh yeah. <laughs> well we have a lot of deaths, so it's definitely definitely dark history. I mean do we're in the court room. All right. do, 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 um, <laughs> take some photos of the actually go in the judge's chair, sit in the judge's chair, and you can <laughs> act to be Polaroids. Polaroids. Yeah. Polaroids of yes. the judge's chair. Well, actually yeah. actually mimic a judge. Yeah, let's do send it. him down. Yeah, replicate it, bro. I'm gonna send you down. Yeah, yeah. Let's try, try to just send me a scene. Yeah. yeah. We, oh, there's a lot. We can We're gonna act it out. Yeah. Question: yeah. Do we uh, do we know like how many people died of hanging here? Um, records are a little bit sort of yeah. dodgy, but you are looking at 40, 50 people. 
Wow, uh, still, that's crazy. Many more tried, obviously, but hanging-wise, yeah. That's, that's still a lot of people. And some of them are still here. Mm. Wow. Because they were buried on site as well. Yeah. Wait, wow. It was one of the only places in the country where you could be uh, arrested, um, tried, condemned, and executed on the same day. Dang, um, that's... Could you imagine ever, that? Ever, ever, probably. Yeah. Wow, so this, is, this place is definitely you could, some You could come in on a, on a Monday morning and be buried on a Monday afternoon. Shh. That's... Okay. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah. All right. Holy crap. All right, let's go down there and see the... Okay, the yeah, public viewing gallery as well, all, all, all along there. We do tend to get an, um, a lot of, what we do, ghost hunting, almost like darting figures coming along. So if you are sitting sort okay. of quietly, just be aware of what's going on up there. You are right. And people wow. sort of being watched. Yeah, play. diving behind. Okay. Um, Dude, we've never been in like a courtroom in, in general. No. Well, for hockey yeah, stuff too. Yeah. Remember? Oh, and we did. Sheffield. Yeah, this reminds me a lot. Like it. Yeah, we was in the abandoned Sheffield court. That's not as cool as this. You guys are. No, it's cool. not. It wasn't. To be honest, it wasn't. Yeah, that as cool. Was pretty cool. It was cool. Though. We had to climb a drain pipe to get in. That's boring. Okay, so the the, the, uh, the condemned men, whether they're going to be sent for execution, sent for a return, or um, sent to Australia, this is the route they would have taken. It says we have get two prison cells yeah. down there. Now this cell is particularly very, very active. This was what we call the night cell. So if there was anybody that were arrested for um, drunken behaviour, prostitutes, uh, anything like that, they were put in here uh, for the night, sober up, come together, and then they were taken up for their, their court the next day. It's good. It's colder down here. I have to find my gloves. Whoa. Oh, nice breeze down here. Yeah. The shackles, bro. Yeah. Damn. The shackles. This feels like a straight-up medieval prison. Oh. Did the shackles still work? Yeah, yeah. We've got a key for them. I just want to check before I lock myself up when we're doing a long visual. Yeah, they're open. All right, okay. Oh, nice. <laughs> You're going to shackle yourself for the yeah, video. Yeah, All right. I think, so, yeah, why not? Yeah, why not? Then I think we each get something. Okay, yeah. We should each yeah. have a turn in here. Just prop your camera up in it in the corner in your night vision, chain yourself up, you're gonna sit in the complete black. I you can't see that. anything. You get a lot of lights lighting up. Really? Yeah. Really? Cool. That that will be fun. Yeah, we could do all that. Yeah. Almost like pinpricks of dots of light, pinpricks all right, of light. Alright, yeah. yeah, okay. Josh just won't go first. I'll, I'll never go in first. I'll go first. No. I'll sacrifice. Right now. I'll sacrifice myself for the content, whatever yeah, it takes. Whatever it takes. I'll take one for the team. We need him every time. I'll take one for the team. Josh will never take one for the team. Never. 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 Everyone knows by now, it's usually someone else goes first, and I wait, and then I decide if I feel like going at all. That's, that's why yeah. Josh is going to live longer than all of us. Yeah. yeah. Just saying. Yeah. If this was the condemned man's cell, the doors then, we'll see there from the outside, he would step out, walk down the steps onto the gallows, rope, and... What do you mean by him? Oh, so he spent his last night in here. So oh, if, you, okay. if you were condemned to death, this would be your place where you'd spend the last... Uh, so your last night. day. Yeah, yeah. So when you open yeah, these doors, what, what can you see? Is it... If this, when, if there's nothing out there now. It's, it's just you just step out into nothing because we've still got two floors, but the, the gallows were underneath. Whoa. Right, so, so is, yeah. can, you see the, can you see the sky from outside here? Yes, yeah. Right, okay, because it just feels like we've gone down quite a lot. Yeah, no, we're still quite high up. Oh, right, okay. Yeah, because the galleries are built on to something like that, so right. it's up here. Okay. I'm going to sleep here at night. Yeah. <laughs> well, you'll definitely wait the dead we are snoring, bro, so. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Dude, it would be Oh, my God, could you imagine the echo? Oh, my God. Dude, I'd be upset. <laughs> Imagine it's your last night on planet Earth and you've got Steve next to you in the cell snoring. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, you're paying for that. Yeah. <laughs> okay, various other holding cells. Um, when we're sort of doing our ghosts, we sort of tend right to here. get all the doors in position, get people in each cell and have somebody pacing up and down, to, uh, almost like reenacting being a prison warder, right. shouting and get back in your cell. Let's do it. That's yeah. a good idea. That's all. Yeah. This was the exercise yard for the, uh, the prisoners. Okay, great. Yeah. Um, some of the bodies from the executed are here, still underneath. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> That's true. Okay, it's where, it's where the street was, but it, it's a mock-up now, so it's, but you, you're looking top of the original floor in Lion Square. square. Yeah. This is cool as hell. Yeah. Dude, look at this, actually. Oh, bro. Wait till you see this. Whoa. Feels like we're walking oh, through Bower Stone Market. Yeah. Fable. What exactly was this? Look at this. Dude. Okay, well, it was an area of Nottingham called Narrow Marsh. 
Okay, um, it was the poorest, poorest part of Nottingham. Oh, um, wow. okay. Winding eyes, dark, crowded, rubbish was left in the streets, a lot of sewerage was running through here. The, the drinking water was just like brown and dirty. The houses were falling apart, mice, everything was, yeah. Huh. So the prisoners felt that sorry for the poor, unfortunate souls that lived here. They fed them some of their own rations. Right. So the, the actual street was here? Yes. Was the, here? The original sort of right. flooring. Okay. Well, obviously these are a, a, a mock-up. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You know, you know, well, this, this, is, this is like real solid stone. It's probably yes. got some kind of quartz crystal in it. Yes. So residual energy might be life in here. Uh, I'm sorry. Are you switched? Yes. I am tell you. Yes. Yo, he's locked set in, but he's locked in actually. Look at look at the spider! Look at look at the dog! Yo, just let me out! Bro, we can't yeah, get. Bro. There's a what fucking spider over there! What? Oh shit! You know what, Seth? What did you get yourself into? I don't know! <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> let me out, bro! <laughs> Yo, with the wide lens, it looks funny! I feel like one of the prisoners. Yo, Seth, get, get out of the boat! Oh, there is a big spider Yo, actually. Let me out, bro. No, I mean right, it. I mean it. Tour, guys, I am gonna get you out. All right, all right. Let's right, see you, Seth. All right. All right. Yeah, right, well, we're gonna get you out. <laughs> bro, Can you lock in? Yo, show your light. Watch it. Just look. It's kind of. Bro. Yeah. <laughs> 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 oh, right, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming. Here. Right. I didn't mean that. I didn't mean that. <laughs> oh, dude. I think it was the bathroom area. Yeah, it's just a bog. It's what, it's what they call a bog. Yeah. Dang, so that, dang. How do you get in it there? Well, I volunteered. 500 <laughs> years of people pissing in there. <laughs> dang, so <now>. dang, <laughs> dang, Good job, Seth. So the, the doors are super small, though. Yeah. I think the average height of, a, of a, an Englishman back back in, like, 1400s was about 5 foot 2. It's so like Seth's height. Bro, I'm 5 and 9. <laughs> well, do you, well, do you want to know something really interesting? Yeah. You know, we always think of Vikings as massive beans. Yeah. yeah these big, yeah, they wasn't. The average size was five foot eight. So they were, but, they were just bulky. But compared to the, the Englishmen when they invaded, yeah. they were seen as giants because the average was five foot two. You got all these five foot eight guys rocking up on the shore. Dang. That's See, why they were, axes and stuff. So yeah. I'm, I'm a Viking. You're a Viking person. Yeah. So yeah, you're at the average height of a Viking, I bro. I care for it. Just That's saying. True. You got to get a Viking tattoo. Yeah, I do. Okay. I'm you an English breakfast. Get out yeah, of here. Yeah, he owes me food, too. <laughs> 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 that's what's... No, I, I got that. I that's thought it was me. I mean, my eyes kind of... I got you, bro. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Your big-ass flash, like, flashed him so hard. I know, yeah. He was like, oh, I can't see. No, 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 I got his face. <laughs> <laughs> This is actually a solid place. Hey Steve, Steve, did you notice I carried on coming towards you though? Yeah. I did, but you guys see your face. I was ready, I was ready for I was ready for giving you a jab. Yo, look at these tankards. You want a drink? Well oh, I've got some of these at home. They're oh, made yeah. of they're made of pewter. Yeah. So these are commonly uh, made of pewter. Now these are definitely pre 1800s because you would normally have a glass bottom on the bottom of it. Um, can you tell me why? So you could see what you were drinking? Yeah, kind of. So what would happen is the King's Navy would be out in full force in the pubs and guys who were drinking heavily and drunk, they would come over and drop a coin in it. Now that meant that was the first week's wages for being in the Navy. Uh -oh. So when they got to the bottom of it and retrieved the coin, they had they was enrolled automatically into the Navy. So they started putting glass bottoms on. So when you get your beer, you just check, make sure there's not a coin in it and you can yeah. drink it. Oh, yeah. Okay. Well, wow. History lessons with, with fighters, you already know. Thank you, bro. <laughs> Thank you so much for that. Smart guys. Yeah. I am yeah, so excited for this video. I've got so there's many there's ideas wall. already. I'm going to be gone. Parkour. 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 Feels different. Mm, yeah, this is um, what's called the debtors' prison. So if you owe money, um, you could be put in here until you actually paid off, or your family paid off your debt, and then right. you would uh, you would be released. So they'd be like a almost like a separate prison. So they'd be like a prison warder who would live in here. This would be his little room, and okay. his prisoners would be sort of kept in here. So they'd just be basically locked in. Um, owe oh, money, you pay your, you pay your debt, we let you go, or your family pay your debt. 
But if you don't, if you don't pay your debt, you don't go. But while you were in here, your debt was getting higher because you had to oh, charge for being in here. Dang! Why wow. now? You might, you can be in here forever if you don't pay your debt yeah. off. Yeah, yeah. It was, a, it was a tough one. Well, he owes me a full English breakfast. <laughs> Andy holds me a subway. Uh, what else was it, Josh? Uh, he owes him some stuff. Pine, he owes, me, he owes me quite a few and things. And Steve owes me a Starbucks coffee. Hey, I brought your phone over here. Oh, uh, that's yeah. a good point. I owe you nothing. Steve's courier well, service over here. Well, he owes me some here. stuff. <laughs> yeah. Everyone owes us some stuff. I owe Fire some stuff. I, yeah, yeah, you know, actually, I owe you. I owe you about $2,000. Yeah, he so. does, he does. You're down on you. Don't make people things. Well, this is super old in here, though. Okay. These are different, various different methods of Guy. shackling, Damn. restraints. We've actually witnessed these on more than one occasion. I'm not going to touch it because they do go... Swing, okay. Oh, swing. swing, yeah. Wow. All yeah. right. Okay. So we've got original prison, his original cell doors there. Original cell doors, so it's still carrying a lot of stuff energy around. Wait, this is the one from the 1800s? Or 14? Or these, yeah, these, these, going back, these are early. Yeah. Holy crap, this is cool. Yeah. Good luck, Steve. Watch this. this. What up, boy? Oh, oh okay. Steve, That's right. Good job. Yeah. You are a really <laughs> Whoa. Okay, that's, that's one of the original. Oh, there was two cells. The ones I'm <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. That looks shit scared me then. Like, oh shit. <laughs> Basically, you're in soldier confinement down here, so you're left on your own. Right. Okay. Well, if you go in there, it's actually pitch black, you can't see that in front oh, of you. Sh- you were given uh, three buckets every day. One contained bread, one contained water, wow. one with empty. Now, in the pitch black, it didn't take you long to get confused what was wrong. So you're just sat there in the dark? Yeah. That was it. Paul, what's this? Well, how long were you there for, you think? Uh, it depends on the punishment that they give. Yeah, could, be, could be days, could be weeks. Oh my god. But you'd go, you'd go crazy. Yeah, dude, after like, what, two days yes. of darkness, yeah. I'd lose my mind. This is, could be the worst one ever. I wanna, we gotta do some stuff in here. In the dark, here. Yeah. Go by ourselves. One at a time in the dark by ourselves. Okay. In there. We each have our own, obviously guys, we're all filming our own different video. You'll have our own different segments inside there. Just That's a good idea. One thing I will say though is you can, I can tell you guys aren't underground guys. Yeah. Because I've already spotted this and I'm seeing these ladders and I'm asking, can I go down there? <laughs> yeah, what it goes it's underground. Can, can, we go, can I go down there? It's locked in there. That's the oh, it is. Can we ask permission to that? What is that? That's like the original I bet to the place. It, there's it's there's a few tunnels. caves underneath here that they um, sort of unearthed and used. There's one cave in particular called a, a new No, no. You know the new No. It's French for forgotten. So basically, you were you were dropped down there. What? And just left. And you're just forgotten. Forgotten. If some of the ubelets had uh, like a bed of spikes, so you would drop down maybe 10, 15, 4. If you were lucky, you'd be fall on the spikes and you'd die. What? If you were unlucky, you'd get a lot of infection and the rats and maybe even other people down there would eat you. Oh my you'd god, probably know there's black plague still down there, dude. Yeah. Well, you've heard of Robin Hood? Yeah. 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 Robin Hood, he, he, he's, he's a nemesis, I suppose, the Sheriff of Nottingham, is he was based here. So it is and one of the stories of Robin Hood. Robin Hood was actually held here and escaped from a new billet. Oh, Bro. dude, that's sick. Wow, that's so he, he sick. escaped from something like this? Yeah, Yo, well, shout out to Robin Hood. Wait, how, how do you escape something like that? You're how Robin did he? Hood. Well, that's yeah, why he was... Robin Hood, bro. He yeah, it's Robin Hood. He used to live in the forest, wasn't he? Living off the land. Yeah. Okay. But Paul, serious question. What's it going to take or how much is it going to cost to let me down here? <sighs> we can, I can ask the security, security guard. Yeah. Yeah. Right, if I can get down there, I'm in my prime. There's a few of these around, so as we go around. That's... Right, so. That looks amazing. Bro, if we can get... I mean, it doesn't matter because we have this really cool stuff, but... It, yeah, but that's next level. Yeah, that would be This neat. only goes in the video if we actually get down there. If not, we'll just cut that part out for our video. We might be actually exploring the Forgotten. You did say Ooh, people... You did say people good. were buried here, too, like, on the site, right? Yeah, in the exercise yard. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. yeah. Dude, this, we're doing solo... What we call the pits. I mean, we do the intro. We could eat before we don't. Yeah, you guys want to do that? After we're done with everything with Paul, we just go eat and then. What's it with you wanting to eat all the time? Well, I'm, I'm just saying, if we're all gonna hungry, I know, I know Steve's hungry. You're hungry, Steve. Stay up all night. Hey, don't say that to me. Yeah, it's, it's just Josh. Josh. I'm just, fine. Oh, we're I'm all fine. It's just Josh. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, here's the guy looking for food. <laughs> Yo, I'm just a little hungry just to get through the night, but it's not that bad. We can we can get new burritos to the cells. Just saying. You think they'll come in? The reads? Oh no, because that would be sick. As well. Just sell, sell 13, 14, and fifteen. 
<laughs> yeah, on, on the Dude, Uber Eats app. Dude, what if we had Uber Eats coming? We oh, actually, yo, you want to come down here real quick? Yeah, Dude, yeah. Like sick. I did, like I did with the delivery guy. We should, we should. Oh yeah, I know. I'll just give him fifty quid. I was like, do you want to come in the cell? Fifty quid. Dude, that would be it's gonna be looking like, what the hell's going oh, well, on? Wait a minute, hang on a minute, though, real quick, because we just seen this. This is another one. Yeah, oh, are those real? Oh, they're not oh, real. Shit. Dude, I thought they were real rats. Look at them. Dude, this is nuts. This was very, very, very early prison. Yeah, look at that. Look at them. So, dude, the rats would just probably cause infection to the yeah, humans. Yeah, yeah. So then, so yeah, because there, there was no antibiotics back then. No. I That's mean, nuts. I didn't even know that. Starving prisoners would eat the rats. Yeah. Oh. Let's what? do the cave then. Okay. okay. All right. All right. Okay. We're now heading down to the caves. And I didn't know this actually existed until just like 25 minutes ago. Whoa. Whoa. Down it's the caves, boys. We're in the caves. There's caves? Yup. In the UK. Only in the UK, man. I know. This is like the Paris Catacombs. Almost. A place, a place to, to be, be forgotten. forgotten. The Ubalat. Yeah. Ubalat. Wait, right. the dungeon known as, yeah, how do you say it? Ubalet? Ubalet. French to forgot. Ubalet. Oh, this is another Ubalet. Ubalet. Yeah. Right there. All right, this, this is nuts. What's that? I see light down there. Think. You think someone's down there? That's, that's where it is was. Is Pennywise the... there? Yeah. Pennywise? <laughs> You're welcome. Well, there really is a light there. Hey, come down here, child. <laughs> so nothing, because it, it's, um... It was known. It is known as the city of caves because yeah. it's built on sandstone. It's so soft. People dig, used to dig down. They used to live sort of underground. Um, they used to carry out a lot of sort of work in tannery and places like that. Poor people lived underground as well because they haven't got houses. Um, so this is one of the caves that dates back um, to probably about the 1100s. Oh my God! It's even older than the building itself. Yes. Yeah. That's nice. Yes. So this is that's how old this place is. Boys. This is officially the oldest place that I personally have ever been on planet Earth in my life. This is insane. I don't know if I've been in anything older, to be honest. Ancient Ramen. Ancient Ramen's older? Uh, you yeah. can see where it's been hand, hand chiseled. Yeah. It seems very soft. You could open it. Oh, yeah. Like yeah. yeah. Oh, my God. I feel like it's going to collapse. I'm scared. You gotta watch out. Dude. The echoes in here are nuts too. It's actually warm in this one. Yeah, it's warm in the caves. I think mean, because we're going underground, it's a constant 14 degrees. Look at this. Look at the water. It's a cave under a freaking prison. Yeah, for real. Legit looks mummified. Oh my god. Whoa. Dude. What the hell? He's in a bad way, isn't he? Oh, yeah, he's, yeah. He's upset. Almost looks real. Yeah, it does. What do you think his name is? Jeffrey. <laughs> it looks like a Jeffrey or a yeah. John. You think it's John James III? I think it's John, John James Jeffrey III. Yes. I like that. Or James Wellington, maybe? I think it's John Uray. You said <laughs> John <it>. Uray. <laughs> the best way to get activity in here is being here all together, yeah. but sort of spread out. Yeah? yeah? Yeah. An almost challenge, what's in here? If you want me out, come and, come and get me, come and move me. All right. Um, that sounds like it's right up your alley. Yeah. Why do you yeah. see yeah. that? Yeah, let's see it. Some, see it. There is something in it that's very dark, it's very tall, and the only way I can describe it is you'll get in your personal space. Really? Yeah, you'll, you'll want to step back and not know why. So we could end the video can here. Can we turn off our lights in here too? This, this could be end. the, okay. the, the grand climax. finale. Yeah. Right here. I think yeah, so. What if it's, the whole video what if it's James Jeffrey the Third that's running at you and you just don't see him? It could be him running at us, we just don't know it. Yeah, you're right. Probably about six months ago now, there's a guy that's been on a lot of public events with us, a guy called John. Um, oh! oh yeah. Okay, John. sorry. Um, ex, <laughs> ex, John. Um, ex military, and he was roughly where you are. Right. And um, oh, we were just a few people around the circle, all of a sudden he lurched forward, something had given him a uppercut oh. in the ribs and, uh, uh -oh. and he died here and that's him right now <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. he was a big guy we left after that pretty oh, quick wow. oh wow yeah. that's scary yeah. 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 he got hit by an uppercut yeah yeah like I'm sure you can yeah yeah sure sure you can oh I did good right there alright thanks <laughs> oh, that was really good yeah that's a good story that was good right yeah great pronunciation yeah I was, I was impressed yeah, was it? Uh, I don't think I can do that. Try it, Steve. Joke! <laughs> 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 Alright.
there would be anything up to 10, 15 women at a time in living in this room. In this one, in this yeah. one room. Yeah. And uh, if, if you do sometimes, if you lie on the bed, you will actually feel the bed shake. Yeah. 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 Oh. Common occurrence, so almost like a, you, you obviously feel it vibrate, but it is a very solid bed. Would they all sleep on the same bed? Sleep on the same bed, on the floor, on the benches, yeah. Okay. Alright. Yeah. What the hell are you thinking? I mean, I, I'm I, not thinking. I, I, was, I just don't want to say what I was thinking. <laughs> I wasn't thinking anything. No, I wasn't. I was just like, well, I think I really want to investigate in this room. Yeah. It could be really haunted. Yeah, you never know, dude. Could be a nutty room. That's all. <laughs> <laughs> okay, boys, we just had the best Taco Bell ever on a diet, but we need a Taco Bell. But I'm just gathering the stuff uh, that I need. Gym tomorrow, 100%. Um, I'm going to take the Polaroid camera, I'm going to put a new one in that. Um, I'm also taking the CCTV. Um, I'll take another one of these IR lights. Close that up. On to the next one. We will take from this one, full spectrum camera from the lone visuals, because it does do night vision as well. Uh, music box, got to take the music box. REM pod, definitely. Cat balls, yeah, 100%. And we had a lot of stuff going on with the, with the uh, K2 meter yesterday, so I will take this as well. That's probably what I'll take, because Josh has a bunch of stuff as well. We'll probably use Josh's spirit box and EVP recorded the R60 already. No, no problem using my kind of, you know, what, what, what would you call my... My my uh, EVP recorders. Uh, just an EVP recorder or yeah. a Panasonic, maybe. Is that what you got? It is. It is. It's same same model as yours, but not the DR60. It's oh, okay, one of yeah. the small ones. But I just call it a peasant EVP recorder. Because yeah. yeah, I'm a peasant. But, right now. but the thing about mine is mine's very unclear because it was made like 50 years ago. Um, so when you use yours, if something comes out of yours, which is it's harder, but if something actually a voice comes to your EVP recorder, it's gonna sound super clear. That's better than mine. Right. Okay. I'll bring it. Bring Good it. point. Good point. Yeah. Right, so right now we're going in the courtroom. This is going to be uh, he's interesting. He's destroying the place. He's Looking forward to seeing what we get. I don't think he's going to protect us. I mean, that's... that's Dan, should be the judge. Yeah. Okay, I'll be the judge. And we need to be like, where do we sit for the jury? Um, like so... Right so... So... Uh, yeah, so the jury will prob probably be on this side. Okay. Um, and where does that the criminal would be in here? Okay. We'll put a ramp around here. Uh, members of the public will sit back there, such as um, like uh, newspapers and right. stuff like that. All right. Uh, I think that's public gallery as well at the top. Mm. Okay. okay. So we get a car. This should be that. Right? This should be interesting. I think. All right. So so Anne's gonna be the judge. I don't know what. I'm gonna be your, but you're gonna be. I don't, I don't want. I just want to say. I think we should be jury, and we should jury. put rent pods next to where the people would be. Oh, yeah. Like but you know, like told yeah. Or, or do you not want to use getting here and, and act like you are one of the criminals alongside a couple of these? We could do that. What if we do two? What if we do two different versions? Okay. One version that way, one version without. Because what if we have the rem pod be the? What if someone actually reenacts the rem pod, like the K two meter thing? Yeah. We ask the questions. It sounds like a good idea. I'm yeah. down for that. I like both ideas. Okay. Yeah, yeah switching it. Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll try a different ones. Yeah. All right. So, which one do you want to do first? Hmm. Um. Uh, hmm. Yeah. All right. I'd like the rem pod be the guard. Uh -huh. I like that idea. Too. All right. Okay. Let me try and find a wig. Okay. Oh, yeah, try to find a wig in the back. Right, if I can find a wig, that's it. We're, we're done. <laughs> right, okay. We've been setting stuff up for a while. Full spectrum camera is going to be facing this way. I also have uh, REM pod, the K2 music box, as you can hear. A couple of cat balls, one there, one there. I'm going to be up as the judge, and we've got a bunch over there. We've got my other trusty custom REM pod. We've got the normal REM pod. We've got the K2 meter. Oh man, we got stuff everywhere. You guys ready? Four. Right, that is recording. Full spectrum's on. That's that's definitely working. Yeah, that was getting me. Yeah. Holy shit, as soon as I sat down. Amen. Hey,
could be a judge. Spirit. Could be. I mean, they took the job that seriously. Right. Even in death. And you're sitting on the judge's chair. And I'm sat in the chair. You might be pissed off. It's like he's a chair. chair. Imagine not being a judge and you're sitting on a judge's chair. I'll come just on. Right in. I know, I'm just already feeling bad. It feels cold to you. It actually feels cold. Does it? Yeah. Let's give you a start. Okay. Members of the jury, we are here today to decide the fate of the defendant, Mr. Jeffrey Johnson. Or should we use a real name? Jeffrey Johnson sounds like a real name. Well, that was our own name from the guy in the cave. Oh. What was the real one? John was, we could just say John. Just... Defendant, Mr. John. He has been tried for murder at the first degree and today you decide his fate. Based on the evidence given, I believe him to be guilty! <laughs> Bro, just work on vibration. Yeah. I, it looks like it. Maybe we should move it somewhere else. Who's up there? Who's up there? Oh yeah, I hear that. No, yes. someone's up there. Yeah, I hear it. I just watched them walk past. Can you see saw somewhere? Yeah, yeah, up in the top corner on the left. Someone just walked past, someone's up there definitely. Might be, might be the security guard. Yeah, that's not... Oh, say that, I can hear it. Well, he was saying it's here. That's the base room. What? That's, that's the one on the left? That's the safe room. No, it, no, it wasn't. It was up on the back bit, on the left, on the back. No, he's down the Right there? Yeah. No, well, no, the door's no. locked. They tried getting in there. Wait a second. Can't even enter. But Paul said that, that you'll commonly see shadows walking around. Oh, oh that's true. It's probably like old reminiscent things that are walking around. No, I, cle I clearly saw it. I clearly saw it. Yeah? I clear as day. Okay. Excuse me, who's up there? Yeah. 
Yeah. She was yeah. just going straight into arena. I mean, which is not bad. It was worth a try, but yeah, yeah. Like, I just don't think it's going to work. Okay, we're going to rearrange uh, this because there's not much going on. There's some stuff going on on the balcony and there was footsteps here. You probably picked them up on the audio, but nothing else major. So we're going to rearrange and try something else. Why are you sitting here in this chair right now? What did you do wrong? Nothing. 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 That's how you know it doesn't always work. It's not always good. That's true. How many people have you sentenced to death? If you are alive right now, would you still sentence people to death? Should we go downstairs into the cells to speak to the people you killed? Yeah, that would be a fucking crazy one. All right. Mm -hmm. Cool, let's see what we got. Come on, baby. Oops. Nothing. nothing at all, bro. Yo, that's the first time I've heard nothing on that. Nothing. Thing. That's what I'm saying. Whoa. I mean, that, that still is really cool for me, too, because for the most part, I've always heard replies back, and this time, it doesn't reply back to anything, mm. so it kind of makes me believe that the voice recorder is, is, is legit. Real. Yeah, like, it works. It is real, my friend. I've never heard it do that before. Okay. Yeah, I mean, that's, it is a I would never spend $4,000 on a week. Well, we, that's get, it. we get spoiled with that thing. We, sometimes it just doesn't happen. Well, the thing is, every time we're on video, Seth, we get the craziest stuff. So this might be one of those, but let's let's not go the, the negative yet. Dude, the prison is where everything's at. Yeah, yeah that's what I'm thinking. No one's dropping flies yeah. in, in the courtroom, you know what I mean? They're dropping flies in the prison. <laughs> <laughs> so we should maybe just squat in the prison now. That's yeah, yeah I, mean, I reckon. Even the energy here, it doesn't feel like anything. But when no. I think about the prison, I feel like... 
Yeah, I mean, it was it all changed as soon as we went downstairs. You could feel yeah, the difference. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. 100%. All right, yeah, I mean, hey, so guys, this is how you know we're not bullshitting you guys. I mean, yeah, that's so, true. Let's head inside the prison. All right, we're heading downstairs now. Okay. This is where it's really so going to kick off, I think. Cells. How do you, how should we do this? Well, you've got these ones here. Yeah. Now, these ones were used for the um, last last night prisoners who were going to die the next day. Okay. And there's four or five of them. And there's four of us. Exactly. And then five would be the ghosts. Okay. Exactly. So we stay each in one cell? Or I mean, we one? could do, yeah. We could shut the door behind us, lock ourselves I think, in. I think all the, are they wall privately? This one's private. Oh, my other one's private too. Yeah, I call the biggest one. This one's not private. They're all not private. Well, the other two are over there. So two people have to stay in this one. And then two people get to each individual on the other side. I'll get an individual one. I mean, I don't, I don't care. I, 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 can take, I can crash with someone. Yeah, it? I'll take an individual. All right. All right, looks like it's me and you again. So should we go back into VR? Should we go? Oh, should we, do, oh, we should do lights out then. Yeah. Yeah, yeah we should do lights out. To and stay quiet. Say, oh, we can do lights out and let's put some cat balls or REM pods in each, like the hallway. Yo, yeah, yeah, yeah let's do that. Hey, all right. Well, good luck, guys. Good luck. Good, good luck, luck in your own cell. All right, I'm switching to night vision. All right, we're all switching to night vision, turning off all the lights. We're gonna sit in silence. All right, guys. Everyone. Right. All right. Yep. Okay, let's all get possessed. Right. Good luck, uh, boys. Just scream if you need help. Yeah, yeah. It is pitch black in here. And I'm just sitting against the wall. Oh my god, it's so dark. I can just see a red light from the REM pod. Music box. Music box is going off. That was mine. Let's scream. Someone should scream for help. Help! on there that you can make beep and I cannot see anything right now apart from a red light over there so if you want you can brighten the room up and there's also a little ball on the floor that lights up all you need to do is touch it Currently sat on the floor where a lot of prisoners would have been away in death.
Is anyone in this cell with me? All I need you to do is make a release into this device here. Music box. Is that you? Grass on my head. Who is it? She wants to rise on my side. Josh, where are you? I'm over here. Where? Hang on. Are you in your cell? I'm in my cell. Now I'm going out to move it. This would never go off. Mine never just fucks around like that. This camera has been running the whole time, so I can literally show you. Yeah, the mine. I've got CCTV running, and I've got my camera there running. There's yeah. nobody in this hallway, and that thing just went off that whole time. Yeah, I know, we have all, all that to protect that. That is insane. I mean, I'll move it over and I'll do it again, but that was creepy, dude. That never happened. Did you guys work for that? No. no. I mean, you heard me opening my cell. Look. Yeah. Yo, I moved it again. Just and in case. And my music box went off as well. Yeah, twice, right? Wait, hang on, you know what? Just now that we're all here, let's, let's just ask them. Okay. Let's just ask them real quick. Right here, ready? Did you just hear a whistle? Wait, guys. Oh, yeah. In the hallway right now? Yeah. Yeah, we're gonna do EVP real quick in the hallway. I probably heard that. Yeah, you Yeah, did. come over here, bro. We're gonna ask them who's here with us real quick. I think it's a guard. Yeah, I well, there was footsteps walking up and down as well. Did you hear those? I didn't, no. Oh, yeah, I heard them clear as day. I thought it was one of you. That's why I thought you were in, in the Yeah, I heard some footsteps like yeah, down, that, down right? that way. Yeah, it was down that way. Yeah, let's turn that on. Alright, well, then at, let's ask them now. Let's ask. Ready? Yeah. Okay, here we go. The cat ball in our cell's going off. No. Really? Oh, 
see it. Oh shit. You okay? Yeah, yeah. yeah. He turned on as soon as I got in here, bro. Are you, you swear? I swear to God, I saw the light reflecting on the door. I have it on camera, 100 percent Are you sure? I, dude, I swear. Yeah, hey, listen here. Real quick. Can you who alright, you know what? Fuck it. Hang on, ready? We're going in. Hang on, I'm gonna go turn your music box on. You go ahead. Who's here? We seen you in the cell. We know you're standing right in front of us. If you want to be free, give us your name and we can get you out of here. Did you kill someone? Who's here with us? Are you trapped in this cell? Can you tell us your name and age? Are you the guard pacing up and down the hallway? What crime did you commit? Okay. Right, let's listen to this one. What was that? Oh my god. What the hell? That scared the fuck out of me. What the hell was that? It's not like, get out now. Hang on, that is... I literally have a chance. Whoa. Bro. Who's here? What? Oh, no. Cat ball. Yo, yo, whoa, whoa, whoa. That's your fault. Dude, they screamed so loud for this fucking thing. Watch. Alright, ready? Go back to the beginning. Cat ball's going off. It's like, go! It's saying go! Or is it go? I told you it said get yeah. out, bro. Mm hmm. This cat ball is still going off. Yeah, go! go. Cat ball going off again. Alright, so that was creepy as hell. None yeah. of us shouted, none of us moved. No. That and that is not stop going off. Just so everyone knows, it's been going off this whole time. Yeah, it's going, it's turning off and then it's turning back on. So it's being set off multiple times. It's like it's just standing yeah. there with us. That's been going on for like 30 seconds now or more. Bro, I'm telling you, I saw the thing going off when we were out in the hallway. I believe you now. Jeez. Dude, I don't even want to do that when I get in this. <laughs> Let's just listen and see if we can get more things. Yeah. We should try another DR60. You want to do one more? Bro, if it's saying go. It screamed it. It screamed, I know. Let's see if we can get it to scream again. Yeah, alright. Let's try and figure out, like, what could have said that. Why is it so angry? Yeah, it could be a guard or a prisoner. Okay, I'm gonna stand right here. Ready? Mm hmm. 
Oh, the reflections are so bad, I can't even record. Oh. We don't have to bounce off. Maybe, okay. here. Okay. Yeah, if I do that, it's bad. It's, it's actually just yours. It's so bad. It's like because we're next to each other. Oh, no. Yeah, alright. Oh, it's mad better. You guys are fine? Yeah, I mean, it looks still good. Okay, yeah, because it was so bad, I couldn't even record. Okay. Okay. Alright, we'll do one more then because you want to, Dan. That one scared the freak out of me. Hey, yeah. I mean, we're finally getting something solid, so we have to go ahead and try it. Yeah, yeah I just want to know sure. why it's so angry. Dan. Why it screamed. Yeah, let's ask some questions. Alright, 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 right, ready? Here we go, round two. Who screamed at us? Why are you here? Capo. Capo's going off. Right. And it hasn't done. Is this your cell? Why are you so angry? Do you want us to leave your cell? Where do you want us to go? If you want us to leave, you've got to shout leave clearly. Is it true in the caves there's someone evil down there? Should we go into the caves? That was a whistle. That was in the hallway. Uh -huh. It's not like a yeah, it was like something here with us. Dude, someone just stayed. Dude, it's moving! Is it? Yes, it's moving! Wait, is it? Oh, come in my eyes. It looked like it was wiggling, bro. I might have caught it on camera, I don't know. That would be nuts. If you stood there, set it off again. <gasps> bro. 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 Dan! Bro. Oh bro. Gosh, there's definitely there's someone, someone right here. Thank uh, you. We know there's someone here because they screamed in our DR60. Let's, let's, so let's, 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 let's listen. Thank you for setting it off. Dan? Dan? Look, that's not going off now. Yeah. Oh, Holy shit, Josh, no, 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 why the fuck no, no, no. no. It's okay, it's okay, please God. Was that you that dropped that? I, I mean, yeah, actually it was. <laughs> I can't, I'm not even gonna... Yeah. Was it, was it just a I wish I could blame the ghost, but I really... <laughs> please don't break. Oh my God, <laughs> oh. no, we need the answers. Right, can, can I get a light? Can I get a light? No light? Oh, oh my God. Bro. Oh, I hope this thing's okay. Dude. I hope it's alright. This is the second time I dropped this. One of these times. This thing is worth five thousand dollars. Okay. It better okay. work. Okay, baby. We might have caught dude, it said death, I swear, I don't know. Hang on. I'll it goes. I hope it didn't say death. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Couple. Okay, that's that's how freaking awesome. Okay. Wait, which one am I on? Alright, we're on A, please work. Oh thank God. Yes. Okay, it works. Dude, this is dude, this is just in a crack. It can't move. Mm -hmm. I say just leave it right there. Yeah, let's let's play it. The voice recorder. Okay. Okay, okay. 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 I'm using my strong hand this time. Okay. Hey, my strong hand. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I was on my other hand. Alright, ready guys? For real this time though. Alright. Watch. Is that that? Was that that one? Is that yeah, it? that's the right one. I right, am. Yo, can I say this one's one? Getting confused. Mm -hmm. you need yeah, I need the lights. Sorry. Right. Okay, I'm good. So who is saying that? 
Who screamed at us and it's saying someone? What was that? Oh. Oh. Boys, that's it's a whole ass whisper. Yeah. It's a whole whisper. Someone saying something. After after we you said that, did anyone else speak? No, it's just it's whispering though. It's saying like someone. It's saying two syllables. Let's try and listen to it one more time. We should maybe save it for when we're down there. Yeah, because now we know, we already know there's something going on here. Now it's, they left because it's not going off anymore. We never touched it after that. Yeah. Point. yeah they left the I just, yeah. I mean, if you, if you are still there, could you set it off just so we know you're still here? Or if you want us to leave, set it off. Uh, it seems like I think gone. it's gone. It hasn't yeah. been staying off at all. Yeah, they just left. Dude, what a crazy session though. Amazing. Mm -hmm. We went from not knowing if anything was going to happen until like now, clearly something's happened. The cat girls right. are screaming at DR60, the music box in the hallway going off. Lots of activity down here for sure. Very, a lot of activity. This is great. Yeah. I have an idea. What's up? We should go one at a time into the smallest room by ourselves, one at a time each. Okay. Take my DR60, we'll leave recording the whole time. Just okay. go on by yourself and sit there for like, Three oh my gosh, okay. Jesus. Alright. As we just got screamed at. Alright, yeah. but on one condition. What? You gotta go first. Oh, he's good. Ooh, that was good, Seth. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Yo, actually, yeah. You gotta go first. I mean, I mean everything he's done. That's true. Dude. <laughs> Everyone knows. They're like, he's not gonna go. The viewers are like, you're not gonna go, but I'm gonna go. I'm gonna try it. Legend. I'm only gonna go with this too, and then we'll go one at a time. I'll take the DR60, I'm gonna take a Revlon with me, and that's it. Okay. And we'll each do it together. Like, I'll go first, and you go with my gear, and we keep switching. Okay, sounds good. Right, okay, we've left the cells now. Gone back to normal camp. We are heading down into the basement. All right, guys, so. We finally, obviously, we figured it out that it was down inside the bad dad. Yep. So the idea of this thing, of this challenge, we can take it or not. It could be super bad or super scary, but if we take it or not, we're going to go down one at a time. With the DR60, we'll stay recording. With a REM pod, we're going to sit in the cells by ourselves in that small death area. And then when we're done, we just come back out. We don't have to be in there long. It could be it could get crazy. If something does happen, you're going to want to run. It can get freaky. So we'll just take one time. One at a time. And we'll be able to hear you if something happens. We'll yeah, if I there. scream help, dead ass, I'll obviously get down there. But yeah, we're we'll coming for you. Yeah, all right. I'm going to go down first. I already have the DR60. All right, good all right, luck, wow. Thank you. Yo, guys, <laughs> inside joke. Technically, I asked Dan earlier, like, what do you get? What do you know about Americans? He's like, I know it's about the, huh. <laughs> and then I say it a lot. Josh definitely says it a lot. I say it a lot. Seth it's just, says it too. It's just someone that you never hear a, a British guy or an English guy or even a UK, UK guy saying, and I notice it all the time. It's a constant, yo, uh, it was a good day today, weren't it? Huh. 
<laughs> so, can you not be bothered answering the question? I mean, I would just, if, if someone said it's good, I'm not going to be like, huh? I'd say, no, I'll tell you, the, only, the, the time you will always get Josh to say it is when he's on his phone. Yeah. When he's on his phone, oh, you ask yeah, him a question, yeah. or he's oh, like, yeah. you tell him something, he'll just go, huh? I don't even notice that. I don't even notice that. If you're in America, drop a huh in the comments. Yeah. All Americans, drop the huh. Huh. <laughs> I was like, like a bunch of Minecraft villagers. <laughs> I, I don't even notice. That's so funny. Huh. Right, I'm going. Wait, can, can I not have a light at all? No, I didn't have a light. Uh, you have to use your camera as your light. Just don't drop the DR60 like I did. Don't be cheating now, Dan. <laughs> so what do you think is going to happen to this guy? He's fucked. Yeah. <laughs> He's the most scary out of all. I think so. Actually, no, Seth. I don't think Seth is doing, doing it. What? I can't. Come on, Seth. I can't. <laughs> Hello, um, I just want to apologise first, I know you don't want anyone in here, but I've just come to say hello, and I mean you know no harm at all, if you don't want to speak to me that's completely fine, but it'd be nice to talk to you. How many people are down here? So I'm sat next to the pit. Was you one of the people who were thrown down there? What's your name? I can hear footsteps over there. Is that you? I know a lot of bad things have happened here. But I just want you to know that I mean you no harm. And I'm sorry that this happened to you. The world is a much different place now. Luckily we got rid of this barbaric prison. And now it's a reminder to never turn back to that time. I feel like you're there. I can feel a cold breeze. Do you want to come and say hello? You're completely welcome to come over.
There's chains on the wall. Do you want me to move them? Or will you move them for me? How about I swing this chain? Can you make it stop for me? Oh, it's changing direction. It's not happening against the wall. Is that you doing that? Okay, I'm going to leave now. I just want to say thank you for your time. Again. I hope you find some kind of peace. And I'm ending this now. I feel like something doesn't want me to leave here. Like something actually needs help. I'm willing to help if you need it. Yeah, something was definitely in there. For real? Yeah, someone was walking around, but it felt like it needed help more than anything. So you got, yeah, you I, heard, I, I heard steps, yeah, too. Me too. That's, that's why, why, that's why I said it in the voice record. I was like, that's why I thought it wasn't going to come on. Then I realized it wasn't you, though. Mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, so that's kind of creepy, then. I'm interested to see what we've got on that. Yeah, let's do, it, let's do it out of here, then, since it's just, because, like, Seth's not going, so we'll go oh, you don't do it. we're in a room. We'll go in a room so we can hear it better. Right, okay. And now here. Because if you got something good, you're going to hear it. If you're down, we'll get some really good stuff. Well, I was trying to be as respectful as possible because I didn't want to get attacked down there. Yeah. True. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> now it works. It wasn't working before. steps.
This is the good stuff, boys. I'm not, I'm, I'm not, I'm not actually heard a voice like I come through this. Not yet. No, this is a, this is really good. Ready? Yeah, this is all it's, right. It's all right. Yeah. It's, and it's in a British accent. Oh, yeah. Right. Are you sure? Because it sounds like she goes, hello. I hear all right. Clear. Let's try yeah, let's yeah, it one more time. time. Are you ready? Yeah. Watch. All right. I'm hearing hello. We'll leave it to the viewers. I hear hello. 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 Yeah, let's keep listening. Oh my god, what did I say? Get out, get up, get up, were you sitting? Yeah. Watch this. Oh, crouch down. Watch this, it says get up. Get up. Get up. That was a man though. Yeah. Yeah. Help. Oh my god, straight as clip, watch this. Get up, watch. Help. Help. Get out, I think. Nope. What was that? Go back, listen to Never, no. Nope. That was a man's voice. Yeah, that was a real man's whisper. It was like, never. Never, yeah. Hmm. Okay, I'm going to leave now. 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 Oh, my hand. That sounds like thanks for leaving. This is good. Yeah. Hang on. Thank, thank you for your for time. Or, thank you for it said, it said, thank you for your time. Eric, thank you for your time too. I, I heard it too. <laughs> okay. Holy Roll. shit. Nice, nice. Awesome. That's a Roll. good ass session you got. It, later on, let's let's try and get a better clear audio of that. Yeah, so keep I can, it. I can enhance it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You got this, bro. Holy you got this. Shit. Wow. That was the maybe, best EVP recording. Maybe it's because you're British. Maybe. Yeah, because you're actually. And sympathetic, and maybe that's what it's you Yeah, you were being too. nicer. Yeah. That was crazy good. Wow. Bro, that's that the first time solid. I've actually he ever heard real voices. Because no, right. most of the time it's like distorted. Yeah. But there was a woman's this voice. This was strong. Yeah, it was people just been just sitting in that cell for years. It was very clear. God, yeah. clear as day. Dude, that's a good session, guys. Really, really you good. You sure don't want to go down because it doesn't. It seems like they're quite respectful. Like, yeah, yeah. yeah. Respectful. They, they might leave they you. They seem like nice, nicer now. nice spirits. Uh, oh man, I don't know. I don't. Obviously, I don't want to put you on the spot, I think but. You got this, uh, it's up to you. It's up to you. It's all good if you don't. I yeah, get no it. No pressure. I mean, you could always do some next time, I guess. That's nice. true. There's another locked up cell we're going to be into on this UK trip. Yeah, that's true. I mean, we're not even done yet. We still got the... Oh, right there. oh yeah. Actually, it is right there. Oh, shit. The final boss. Oh. I like how I'm not going to go and do something by myself. But I'm like, yeah, let's go into the cave and do a Ouija board. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's all good. It's all good. Yeah, oh, next, no, no next time I will do something. Okay. All right, next time you heard it here. It's gonna happen next ready, time, guys. Okay. Oh wow. You ready? This is it the last part of the whole session? You ready? Jeez. You ready? Born ready. Look in the door right here. I mean, you know Yo, what they say down here. Wanna grab it? It's <laughs> coming off. What's, of what, what's this? The big Ouija board. Oh, no, oh, we're doing a Ouija board. <laughs> the big one. Boys, you you told me you never do Ouija board. You told we me don't. Yeah, just no, we, we, we don't. We don't. It doesn't look like it. We don't use one. We bring the biggest one. Yeah, this is gonna be the first.
first time that we've ever done it on Beyond the Dark. That's crazy, actually. That's kind of funny at the same time. Uh, yeah, okay. Well, you, you want to do a Ouija board in the place where there's dark entity running around, uppercutting people. Makes sense. Makes sense, true. Steve. Okay. Now you're making me second guess it when you say stuff like that. Go hard or go home. Exactly, yeah. right, exactly, go. exactly. Right. Let's go then. Go hard or go home, guys. All right, here we go. <laughs> oh, man. Good luck. Yo, this entrance looks crazy. It's like someone just. It's not, it's not even, you're not even joking. We're going down to hell. Alright guys, red light right now. The cave, right? the cave where it is literally right here. In the stomach. The cave where there is supposedly an evil entity. Alright bro, this is it, no joke. So Get your red lights on. on. There you go. Right. There's the cave. Alright. Wow. This is it. Feels like a cave for sure down here. Move in oh squad. Oh my gosh, this looks crazy. Move in. See how red it is. Oh, it's misty down here. Yeah, it is. Why is it so misty now? Oh, we have black mist when we got in here. I can't even see. Oh, it's always oh misty. my gosh, just stand here and just look at the mummy. Mm. I could, I, if I could oh see, I missed it up really bad. That looks so scary. Jesus, that thing looks freaking creepy. Dude, I can't even... It's so foggy in here. What if he yeah, just like got up and started yeah. running at us? That's... I take it from a camera, dude. <laughs> that was a good ticket. Alright, alright, so... We'll set up, I guess, right here. Yeah. yeah. Alright. <laughs> I mean, the good thing is... That was <laughs> cool. <laughs> I, I got a fuck... Um, yeah, I just got some energy potion. You know, you ever play zombies? You know the energy potions you get? Yeah. Yeah? Well, that's what's what. Right. <laughs> Man, boys. Looks like it's glowing in your light. <laughs> don't ask what's inside. Yeah. <laughs> if it glows like that, don't ask. Boys, ready for this? This is it. Yep. I, I definitely didn't like picture myself doing this in a video, but facts. I mean, I kind of thought we'd end up doing it eventually, but not sat next to a mummified guy in the yeah. basement. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, shit. Oh my I gosh. Hope, I really hope that, that that wasn't a ghost. Don't scare the fuck out of me. <laughs> yes. Who pushed that off? You think you got pushed off or no? Well, oh, that yeah. was perfectly secure. How would that though? fall off? That was perfectly secure and it's been up there for about 10 minutes. I know, no one moved and, and now it's all about a demon. I, I know. Oh, God. It just felt weird when you said oh, demon. Oh God. Get that shit out of me. <laughs> See, it's perfectly secure. Yeah, yeah. how yeah, would that, that was, fall? That was actually really scary for me. That's real. actually a really good point. Okay. All right. Keep anyway, it. I'm gonna clean the board off. <laughs> Holy fuck! Oh, Already something's been pushed off. Right. Okay. Interesting. Nice. Okay. As I was saying, I didn't expect to do it next to a mummified guy uh, in underground in uh, a hole a demon lies. Yeah. And he uppercuts people. Yeah, and he uppercuts mm -hmm. people. Yeah. What should our intention be? Purely to communicate and gain knowledge, and nothing else. Okay. Yeah, actually, he's right. <laughs> Right. And just, you know, set your boundaries inwardly. Don't don't let anything think it can come with you. And uh, if you have a god, you should pray to it now. First of all, I, I, do you want me to give us some protection? That would probably yes. be a good idea, right. actually. Close your eyes, everyone. <clears throat> okay. Imagine yourself stood inside a small fortress castle with no ceiling on. You sat in a chair right in the middle and nothing is around you. You can just see the walls. But then all of a sudden there's a bright light above and you see this light and it starts penetrating the walls of the castle and it starts moving closer towards you. And you're watching it rolling up like a sunlight touches your feet and now your whole body is engulfed in this light inside this castle and that is your protection light against the dark that's it <clears throat> not bad thanks Dan thanks Dan alright right, I mean last last chance to, to not do it that's true if you feel comfortable about doing this this is a Ouija board. This is a portal to the other side. 
this is your last chance to back out. If you think this is a bad idea, if you've got a gut feeling telling you not to, then I suggest you listen to your gut. Yeah. Do you all want to go ahead with us? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Seth? Yeah. I'm in. Steve? Yeah, my gut feels alright. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. <clears throat> so, let's communicate. So, we so middle. We put in the middle. Yeah. We're supposed to all do it. Two. Wait. Okay. Actually, wait a minute. What? I can't even move it. Like, don't put too much pressure on it. It'll move itself. Maybe not. Who wants to speak? It's actually hard to move. That's good. Yeah. yeah. That's a good thing. Wait, I mean, no, but like, I don't think it's actually going to move at all. I can, we'll see. I can move it. All right. Who wants to speak? Who wants to open it? I mean, if you guys don't want to, I'll do it. You can go first. Okay. All right. If there is any spirit here that wishes to communicate... Please come through the board and communicate with us. Just felt like a cold breeze. Is there anyone here? If there's anyone here, can you give us a sign? I hear there's someone demonic down here. He's quite violent, poltergeist-like. If you can physically harm someone, moving this should be a, a walk in the park. Is there a violent entity down here? Okay. This seriously isn't you guys? No. I promise you. Holy fuck. Look, 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 look at my finger. Yeah. Just don't take your hands off. Is that E? E. e? It won't move. It's just like stop that E. E. Can you spell your name? E. The E might not mean anything. Let's just go with whatever it says right here. V. I kind of already know what he's going to say. Though. Sounds like evil or yeah. something. A V? Started it off almost spinning. Was that high? That's a T. E V E T. That was E V E T. Eveth. H. Eveth. Never heard that name before. What's that? T. T. Doesn't look like T. E V E 
Yeah, it is a T. T H T. I mean, it said evil energy, it said yes. Eveft. 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 Is that your name? Eveft. What if we what if we start over and just ask it to spell its name again? Or what if we just ask <clears throat> something else? What are you trying to say? Is this your name? Are you still here? Do you want us to leave? Do you need help? Are you human? Dude, this feels so weird. Why is it spinning? I don't know. Whoa. What the hell? What was that? What was that then? What did it, it feel like I stopped out of you. H. What was it? It was V. Was it U? H. I. K. Y X K. That doesn't even make any sense. No. Unless it's like a like I don't know. Actually, yeah, I don't know. I X K. Anything. I know, I'm not, yeah. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is that? Q. IXQ? It's all random shit. <clears throat> what was that, H? Maybe the viewers will know at this point. You're keep, um, we're announcing it. I don't know. Actually, it's, and it's just gonna go again. I don't even know if it's answering a question or if it's just spelling something out. The fuck? Where's it going? I X K uh, I. Where's um, that one? Maybe it's saying it's not human because it's not even spelling like any English words. Why is it trying to lift up? Yeah. What the fuck? I don't know. Wait. Is that pointing to? No? This is trying to go to no. No to what? Like, no to leave? Like, do we ask a lot of things? Well, I mean, okay. it's still maybe answering by asking. Should we, like, reset it? Like, in a circle? Way. It's fucking vibrating. It's shaking my hand. Holy shit, it really what is. What the hell? It is vibrating. Yo, the board's moving! Oh, no, maybe it's my eyes. No, I feel like the board's lifting up! Uh, oh, maybe it's not. I don't know. My hand's fucking twitching. Why is it shaking? Can you speak English? This, I mean, this could be all kinds of, any kind of language. Old English or... Yeah, um, that's the thing I was thinking, like, the same. It feels like this, this planchette can, like, be thrown up right now. This is insane. You can hear it. It's making tapping noises. I know, it's moving my own hand. <sighs> Are okay. we... Are we speaking with an inhuman spirit? Look at it, dude, it's like a oh, What the hell? Look at it, it's, it's actually lifted off. It said yes, though. 
Wait, what'd you ask? In I asked human speaking human. with an inhuman spirit. Are we... Inhuman. Okay, the board just moved on its own. I told you the board was moving, I thought. Okay. So it's not human. Okay, let's... let's... Um, no, I think that board moving is me. This was leaning on it there. I don't, I don't know, know, dude. I don't think any of us are touching the board. No, I think no, I it am. was at first. Yeah. I am. Okay. At this point, but the other time I thought it lifted okay, wasn't but, us. But either way, this planchette is moving. Right, 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 right. Okay. Okay. Are we in danger? We would have to reset it and put it back to the middle. Oh, yeah. Should we just put it back? Yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do that. Okay. See, look how difficult it is to no, move. That's, no, that's what I'm trying to say. It's like, at first, I, I said, I said, this ain't gonna move. And it really is moving. I'm being very relaxed too. Yeah, like, yeah. To bro, I'm purposely things. lifting off quite a lot of times. I leave my finger so yeah. that you can see my finger being scraped along it like that. Right. Uh, to show how little pressure is on. Okay, I'm actually. All right. So how how do we reset it? Do we have to like? That was it. Yeah, yeah we just reset it. Yeah, we're oh, in the okay. middle now. Do you want to talk to us? I. It always goes to I. Hell no. Why does it feel like it's gone really quiet all of a sudden? Yeah, like, very quiet. Wait. No. Okay, so what was the late response? There was a late response. Alright, let's reset. I have a question again. Let me know oh, when you're ready. Shit. You're good, you're good. <laughs> Scary. You're not supposed to let your yeah, well, you, you. It's not off the board, though. It's off the plan chat, but I'm still on the board. We're okay. What, what are you talking I'm about? I'm making my own rules, though. I'm making my own rules. <laughs> Is it's off the plan chat, but not off the board. Your fingers are off a boat. I'm thing. hovering, though, over the board. Okay. I got another question. Are we communicating with the entity that our friend Paul told us about? Are you the one that doesn't like people down here. Do you uppercut people? Well, at first we said evil spirit and said yes. That was the first one. He, so he said you've got to provoke it. No, I not with a Ouija board. I just That's don't want to. I just don't want to go too hard. I'm not provoking on a Ouija board. Paul said you have to provoke it. Yeah, well, stop. I don't want shit with a Do you remember that's what he said though? He did say it. Provoking, huh? Yeah, some people do it, but it's not my thing. And not with this thing. I mean, I don't agree with um, provoking like spirits of people, but this yeah, is not. I don't person. want. Yeah, to that's why we're gonna die if we any use human it. spirit. Are we in any kind of danger? Do you not like us down here? I feel like someone's behind us. Yeah, that's why I'm looking over there. Should we leave? Are you still here with us? Where are you? Cold breeze to my left. Yep. Oh, I feel it. Right after the stomping. Cold breeze. I feel it too. It's on, yep. my, it's on my back. Talk to us through the Ouija board. Move what we're holding with our fingers.
D. Is it I? I. E. Die? Die? All right. Nope. Okay. Nope. Um, nope. We shouldn't. We shouldn't keep doing this. Yeah. If you continue to communicate like that, we will end this and close it down. I think we should end it now. Yeah. To be honest. Let's end it. Because we already felt the cold breeze, we heard the stomp, and now it said die, and that was the first and only message. Let's just end Except it. Except evil spirit when it said yes at the beginning of the board. We shouldn't even fuck with this right now. Yeah, let's, let's end this for, for real, guys. You cannot harm us or follow us. No one wants to be followed playing this. I don't want to be followed. You're not welcome to come through the board. We're going to close this session now. You will not do anything to us. Alright. End of communication. Goodbye. Let's spin it around. Dragons a goodbye. Dude, it's so goodbye. Hard to move. Goodbye. Goodbye. <sighs> Damn. I don't even feel that scared about it. I don't feel but I just feel shoes all over my back. No, because it's cold. They're all around now. I feel it. it fucking I don't even it. feel that, like, scared about that that yeah. happened. I just feel like... It literally told us die. Yeah. Yeah, I know. I don't... I feel I like I feel that. like I just... Because it's a Ouija board. Like, I don't... I don't know. Like, I never use one. I just don't get it. Like, I don't know how to, how I should feel about it. I, think I feel confused. It's, it'd be pointless communicating with that because if the first thing it's going to say is die... There's just no point because it's going to be something that's going to swear at you constantly. Yeah. There's no, there's no yeah. decent it's humane said, response. It, it sounds like it's evil not intentions. human. Yeah. It said it doesn't want to talk to so us. And it said evil spirit. The first thing you asked, are you an evil spirit? It went to yes. That's when I was like, oh shit, okay. No, I said, uh, he asked, are you inhuman? Are you an inhuman oh. spirit? So are you not a human spirit? He said yes. Which means we could be communicating with a with, demon. Yeah, okay. Demon yeah. or, and it sounds uh, evil as well. Yeah. Like why would it say die? Yeah, true. The stomping happened. I hope the sound got it. We felt the cold breeze, and now it's fucking cold already in here. And then it said die. I mean, yo, definitely didn't give a shit that we were down here, that's for sure. I'd be curious to see if uh, people have ma been able to make out some about the letters it originally spelled. Yeah, actually, right. dude, yeah, can you like please gibberish. help us out? Yeah, Is it Latin? Because if it was Latin, then it would go with, okay, a demon, because demons are Latin or something. Like some of them are. I Sometimes, heard. I know the, the... Or it was something backwards. Or, yeah, could, that's what I mean. or, or something just, numeral. Yeah, no, something so numeral. What, what you should do is realistically type the words out, maybe comment the words, and then see if other people can spell something out of those words. Oh, jumbled up. Was right. It? I've seen people do that before. Okay. What was it? It was E-V-E. I don't know, but they can I, rewind it. And I don't, rem I don't remember anything else after that. So guys, help us out. T-H-T... Yeah. Yeah, there's a bunch of it. Guys, definitely help us out in the comments. Just rewind and, yeah, just help us out. I'm gonna end my video upstairs. Yeah, I'm, me too. I'm still I'm trying like, to collect my thoughts. Ah, fuck. You okay? Yeah. You got a cramp? Yeah. 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 Okay. We are packing up the goodies. Um, it has been a hell of a long night. It's 5 a.m. in the morning right now. Um, I'm starting to put everything away. I have taken a couple of photos with the Polaroid. If you want to see them, go over to my Instagram. I'm going to put them on my story. Um, they will be enhanced. I'll take a digital photo and enhance them so you can see anything. I think there's only a couple, but from every uh, paranormal explore we do, I will put them on Instagram. So exploring fires on Instagram, you already know. Josh, what did you make of this place? Honestly, it said die to us. I didn't like that, but besides that, everything else has been really good here. I actually thought it was super cool to be here. It's so different. We have a courtroom, a jail cell, a police station, all in one section. That's what I mean. I mean, when have we ever explored a place like this before? I mean, a proper museum. I mean, when we rocked up outside, I was like, are you sure this is the place? This place looks like it costs we about four thousand pounds to rent for the night. Yeah, we rented an entire museum <laughs> for the night. And it's not even just a normal one, it's a national museum. Yeah. A national museum. That's why you gotta subscribe to all of us. You already know. Go and check out the guys. We've got Seth, Josh, and Steve. Subscribe to everyone. Everyone had different videos as well. Don't forget we had the long visuals, so you already know. Okay, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This has been one of the most unusual uh, paranormal kind of explorers I've ever done. This was the Galleries of Justice in Nottingham. Boys, what do you think of this one then? We, did you enjoy it? Come on, come and get in the shot. Oh. What do you think? It was um, terrifying. <sighs> yeah. Well, it said die. 
Yeah, yeah, that's good enough for me die. to stop. If mm. it was if it was truly my choice, I probably would have stayed on the board a little bit longer, just to try and, and reason. But sometimes there's True. no reasoning with stuff like that. You yeah. know, mm. if it's straight away, one of the first things he says is die. You're probably yeah. not going to get much good out of it. No, I don't think yeah. so. I mean, I mean, I loved your EVP session you caught by yourself. That's that was also amazing. pretty but big. That was probably the best EVPs I've heard come from that device because normally it's distorted. Yeah. yeah. I heard clear as day a woman's voice. Yeah. Multiple times. Yeah. They're, they're having conversations. I think and, it was more and than right one. And right at the end, it was what did it say? It was like thank you for your time. Yeah, thank yeah. you for your time. Which is and that, incredible. That sounds like a. Mm, Kind of like that's something we wouldn't say now. No. Like you wouldn't mm -hmm. go into a shop and like be talking to someone and they turn around and say, "Oh, thank you for your time." It sounds mm. like an old-fashioned thing to say. I agree. Yeah, it's like a very old thing to say. Oh, yeah, I agree. I think I think you got some of the best stuff. Yeah. So anyway, yeah. we've got a two and a half hour drive back. It's it, it's quarter to six in the morning. Jesus. We're wow. gonna get back in daylight, oh, but that's how no. it is on these road trips. You already know we don't stop. We keep going. That's how it is. Take one for the team every, every time. <laughs> so Take it for the team.